150 plays. We went a long time today. We needed it. <clears throat> Offense looked obviously a little rusty. Defense is going to be ahead, you hope. And uh, we, we look pretty good today on defense. Hopefully that has to do with something that we've got a lot of guys back. And we're playing a lot of guys. We're playing with a lot more energy because we know what we're doing. We've got a lot of carryover. Um, offensively, it's going to uh, it's going to be a little rough as we go. Of course, I thought we caught the ball a little bit better today than we have in practice. We had a couple of turnovers. It's hard to tell when you don't let your two best running backs go. You know, it's hard to tell whether you do anything on defense or or uh, you know your uh, your backup running backs. Uh, they don't they don't obviously don't have the punch that the first two guys do. But quarterbacks, I don't know. I have to watch the film. Some sometimes they look good. Sometimes they didn't. We looked a little anxious in the pocket. Uh, it looked like we knew what we were doing most of the time, but we looked a little anxious in the pocket. Had a lot of overthrows. I hadn't seen that many overthrows since I've been here. But uh, we've got a lot of work to do on offense, defense. We, our punter uh, pulled a muscle warming up or, uh, early, so uh, both our kicker and punter now are overwatching with me. So we got to get those guys healthy. So that didn't start off the scrimmage very well. But uh, it'll be interesting watching this. Uh, this tape, we'll watch it as coaches tonight, break it down. Players will get back on the bus in the morning. We'll go back to higher ground for six days and uh, back out there for a lot more fun and entertainment. Are you concerned about the offense or just chucking up the clock at the better defense? Well, I hope the better defense is a part of it. Uh, but again, we're you know the, we're not game planning. Our defense has seen everything that we do out of every formation, so you got to give it that too. Uh, we uh, we didn't throw a lot of short routes today. We threw the ball down the field. We wanted to do that. Uh, we throw we can throw the ball short, but again it goes back like I said. We didn't Mike Boone and and uh, Tion, you know, weren't in the game very much. Uh, we got to get better on the offensive line. We know our receivers are going to be young. They got to catch almost everything coming at them. I know they're not, not going to do that consistently, but as we get get into the season, they've got to get more confidence and and play with more consistency. So. Uh, uh, it was about what I thought today. I knew the defense would win. Uh, but uh, next Friday night, hopefully, uh, offense shows a little bit better. But uh, we are pretty good on defense. You know, these guys have been around playing hard. And uh, we didn't uh, play. Uh, Bryce Jenkins didn't play today. Mike Tyson didn't play on defense. So uh, we'll even get better when we get those guys back. Um, Jenkinson's got uh, tonsillitis, so we didn't, we didn't let him practice today. And, but he'll be back. You know, at the beginning of the week. You know, I thought I thought Gunner looked more poised. You know, he didn't get rattled. There was some time he didn't. I don't think he completed as many as, he, he, as the other guys. But he's played. He looks like he's got more confidence. But again, we're going to go with the guy that gets the job done, and we'll have to look at the overall picture, getting the right play, look at the read the right coverage, make the right decision. And uh, but we're going to start cutting it back. Uh, you know, probably midweek, going into the next scrimmage. Uh, I don't know whether we'll have a number one, but uh, you know we'll be getting close to it. Landon Brazil was in the backfield a few times. How's he? Come? Landon's he's gotten a lot better. You know he's getting getting off the ball. He's gained a little weight. He's quicker. He knows a lot what to do. You got to remember all these guys played a lot last year. Might not have been starters, but they played on defense, and that's going to help us. We've got more depth. The offensive line, you know, we don't have the depth there we got on defensive line. So our offensive line is going to get tired. That's the reason I went so many plays today. I want to get the offense tired. Uh, get them back on their heels and see if they'd respond. I thought they did most of the time. How deep do you uh, think your secondary is between the cornerbacks and the safety? Yeah, we're a lot better. If we can just keep them healthy. You know, it's kind of like last year. I felt great about going into the first game and we started getting them all hurt. But uh, Alex Thomas is going to help. Uh, uh, Stevens is much better t at one corner. Of course, we've got Grant. Uh, you know, his problem is, is not playing and knowing what to do. It's just being able to stay out there, you know, staying away from the injuries. Our safeties have gotten better. Malik played last year, starter most of the year, and, uh, you know, he's a backup right now. Uh, Carter Jacobs is a starter along with uh, Zach Edwards. So, uh, you know, we just got more, we got more things to pick from. That's which is good. We, we haven't had this opportunity. Now we just got to get everybody going in the right direction. Start getting about 45, 50 guys ready to play starting this time next week.